Yo guys, back at it, um, back with another video, and this is just going to be a, a really, really quick video going over a couple of things that um, I think might help you guys while grinding for your Great One Black Bear. Um, don't forget, if you like this type of content, to subscribe to the channel, guys, like the video. We stream every day, and we upload videos throughout the week, so let's just get into it, guys. Right guys, there's three key facts that we're going to go through and the first key fact is that I, that helps me with my guide, my, sorry, with my great one grind is working your zones anti-clockwise and there is a reason behind that, this and the reason is um, the lakes that you're grinding your black bear on that are also populated with mountain lion, if you set your time to half three for instance and you start at the furthest um, east lake that you do your grind on for instance down here at, um, dinosaur hill bending forest area start at these zones guys and what you wait anti-clockwise but so by the time you get around to the cougar watch and the narrows <clears throat> sorry guys by the time you get around there your mountain lions aren't coming and drinking because if you have to work it around the opposite way guys and work clockwise around your zones by the time you've got up to two phones the mountain lions would be in drinking and they'd be spooking all your brown bear off before you even seen it, before you even seen them. Or if not, they'd be spooking them off to a point where you, you struggle to get shots in at them. And um, so yeah, definitely, definitely helps me out in my ground if I work anti-clockwise from the top of um, bending forest around. And um, number two um, factor in this ground is um, the bear and nothing like whitetail. What we've seen, we've, we used to just set tents and tripods up, shoot your whitetail reset the time you respawn to being that doesn't happen anymore guys so one thing that 100 percent helps me if you're going to take any, anything away from this video make sure you take this point away guys <clears throat> keeping your tents 250 meters away from the edge of the lake not from your zones guys from the edge of the lake for instance this zone, this zone here this this tent was situated just at the back of here shooting this black bear tent but as you can see there it's now 250 meters away from the edge of the lake and the reason behind that is the black bear move around so often on this map to the point where I have having them spawn on top of my tents and I didn't even realise. I, I did a couple of runs and I was only shot four males throughout the whole of my run. And that, that was because the bear were moving around that consistently. They were sitting on top of my tent sometimes, they just weren't spawning in. So if your, tent, if your tents are situated 250 metres away, by the time you get to that lake, guys, all your bears would have rendered in. Every single one of them. And the third thing, guys, is make sure you pick up every single harvest because I've tried it and you do not get respawns, guys, if you do not pick your, your um, bear up or any, any animal now. It's, for one, it's good for making cash in the game, and for two, you'll never get a respawn. They'll just keep respawning back as the same um, animal constantly. I'm going to throw um, a hotspot map up. You guys have already probably seen it, but for guys that haven't seen it, I'm going to throw a hotspot map up. Um, at the end of this video and show you where I've been um, grinding my black bear and I'll go through a couple of them now this mule deer outpost I'll, I'll just go down and show you now guys if you're gonna if you're gonna focus a ground anywhere on this map definitely check out this mule deer outpost it's absolutely full of bear it might it might differ between players and different maps but definitely worth checking out I'll go and show you now hopefully they, they should be in the zone by now I, should, I sometimes have between 10 and 15 bear here. I'll go and show you. There's no need to have a tent on these um, lakes either. You could probably set up this ground, guys, with four tents. Definitely with four tents. There's a couple of there's a couple of um, lakes that do need your tents on. For instance, this in Bending Forest definitely needs two tents because it'll take you too long to run around. By the time you've got around there, guys, and it's full of big reeds in there, so tent and tripod definitely at that lake if you're going to pick any but the rest of them you can probably get away with just running from your outpost and it'll be better because your bears will have, will have um, spawned in and will be in render they won't be sat underneath any of your tents this spot here guys is an absolute like, gold mine for bear oh we've got an eight there so yeah it's a hot spot i'll take that eight down while we're here guys it's an absolute hot spot for um bears and the reason I have my 308 as well, guys, is because if the um, if the lake's heavily populated like what this one is usually, 
I use my 308, take down as many bears as I can. But if it's only one or two, maybe three bears in, and you're comfortable and you have half decent recoil control, then you could probably get away with using the 300. But at this lake, I can take four and five bear down at a time because usually they flee back around this way. They flee from left to right. And they come into this big, big open area where you can... Um, What we'll do guys is I'll throw a hotspot hot spot map up for you guys when I've just picked up this eight if we can find him. Um, and don't forget if you do like this type of content guys, drop a like, subscribe to the channel, we stream, we upload videos, we have Discord, the link in the Discord will be in the description. I'll put it in the description guys so you can join in. We chat in the Discord. So looks what this guy scored. Nice 21, 7, that's a nice mythical that really. So yeah. Don't forget to like and subscribe guys and um, best of luck with your great one grinding and let us know how you're getting on guys.